Alright, hey, it's Jay from Gag Order. Uh, I'm here with Derek D. Say what up to the people. Hey, how you doing? Excuse my voice, I've been talking all day, but uh, how you guys doing? It's good to be here. He's lying. We saw him. He was uh, hanging out with a girl, you know, eating out. Um, anyway, <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know what else you would call her doing backwards or aerobatics or whatever on your face. I don't, I don't know. Well, you know, every now and then I, I, I tend to enjoy that, you know, um, you know with women. And um, it's a fun thing to do. And yeah, I was walking down the street, and I was doing that, and he saw me. And that's just what I do when I'm walking right down the street. Yeah, I mean, he's got more game than I do. Because didn't you have a pickup line, a thing that happened or whatever? Um, yeah, we tried to start that, but it just, uh, my friend Lauren Francesca and I, just was too, like, to be daily and to shoot, you know, that amount of stuff in a small amount of time was just tough to do. So we, we, had a, we did a little bit. We might pick it up again, but you know, pick up line, daily pick up line might be back. It was a fun little thing. and yeah, I think you should do it because I'd have a line like, hey girl, if you have AIDS, I'm the cure. No? No, that's, uh. that's pretty, it's pretty terrible. Uh, you should have you been on the stage when we had the pick up line contest. You could have used that and failed probably miserably. <laughs> um, so you want to just give people, uh, just let people that don't know who you are, uh, give them a brief insight as to what makes you Derek Deer. What, what have you done? What's the grand scope of your life, starting from when you were young on a tricycle? I didn't really ride a tricycle. It's more of a two-wheeler. But I, um, my name is Derek D. I'm an actor, comedian, host, and uh, I started getting into the business in uh, in college. I actually don't have a, I have a degree in graphic design, but I knew in college I wanted to be an actor, comedian. So I took acting classes, comedy classes, all that stuff. I started hosting and then, you know, just from there now, I just, since 2007, I've been a full-time entertainer and I host a show called Fast Lane Daily. It's like a show about cars, but funny. I've um, been doing that for about five and a half years. I do a lot of stuff for Epix, which is like a premium movie channel. I do voiceovers for them, on-camera stuff for them. And I do live events people hire me for, like College Fest, where we're at right now. And this is my seventh year hosting College Fest, but that's it in a nutshell. I do a lot of sketch comedy um, and skit, you know, skit type stuff and with Barely Political and Key of Awesome as well. Oh, you're on Key of Awesome. Okay, now I know where I see your face from. Yeah, Key of Awesome is awesome. Sometimes I don't get the songs, though, and it just well, makes me want to punch the computer. You know, it's not always songs. Sometimes it's just parodies. Uh, it's just random funny shit that has to do with pop culture right now. Um, but, yeah, they do parodies and they do sketch comedy, and I'm one of the cast members of that whole group. Cool. So you guys can find them online, obviously. Um what do you think of the the crowd out there? I mean, because you said you've been doing it for seven years. How's this crowd compared to all the other ones? Um, yesterday was pretty big. It was it was, it was pretty nuts. Uh, I remember a few years though, especially when we had really big names. Like my favorite was Talib Kweli, and we had Fabulous one year. Um, we had Chitty Bang who wrecked it one year. Um, I mean wrecked it in a good way. They they killed. Uh, Asher Roth was good a couple years ago. Um, Today was a little weak. It's Sunday. You know, Sunday's always a little smaller than Saturday, but it, 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 was, it was good. Um, a lot of energy. Today, not as much energy as yesterday, but uh, what was great was having Kel Mitchell from Keenan and Kel, all that, there with me too. Super cool guy, really nice. Um, just to, you know, me and him bounce off each other. That was fun. Well, what do you think your, your plans are from here on out? Because it can't be, I'm like, you can't be the Dick Clark of College Fest. What are your plans? <laughs> Well, I'm not trying to be the Dick Clark at College Fest. I mean, they they bring me up here and they hire me to do this every year, and it's an easy and fun gig, so I do it, and it's fun. And I love Boston. Boston's a, a I mean, I don't love your sports teams, but I love uh, the town and the city, and it's fun. Um, but where I where I'm looking to go, if I could host something and be funny, I'm cool. Like I host Fast Lane Daily. It's my it's my steady gig. I get to be funny and do it, but. Um, hosting a network show, as long as I can be funny on it, that's cool. But my ultimate goal would be Ben Stiller type movies. Ben Stiller type roles in movies. He's my favorite actor. Oh, ah, okay. So semi douche, non douche. Okay. Uh, what are you talking about? Anyways. Yeah, that's what I mean. In, in, in the movies, you'd play douchey guy. Or he plays the, well, like in, well, in like Dodgeball and Heavyweights and stuff like that. But in movies like Along Came Polly. And see, the thing I like about that is I love comedy, and that's my whole resume. Is my, comedy but I am trained in drama so I like when there's movies where you it's mostly comedy but there's those serious moments where you could you know really be serious drama 
Okay, what, what about a show like Fresh Prince? Because he had serious moments, but then he was all like goofy. But that's a sitcom, you know. I mean, oh, don't get me wrong. I would love to do a sitcom. I thought we were talking in the movie realm. But yeah, I mean, that was still a, it's still a sitcom. and It was great, one of my favorites. But uh, yeah, I would, <laughs> if you're, I'm not sure what you're asking. Yeah, I'd love to be the next Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, but I don't think it's going to happen. No, I think it can happen. There, yeah. there hasn't been an East Coast Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Why wouldn't it happen? I'll be the Fresh um, Prince of Neptune, New Jersey. Hey, that works. Hey, that name alone. Not much of a ring to it. Fresh Prince of Neptune. I don't see it. <laughs> Knights of Neptune. Knights of Neptune. Hey, that works. All right. That's awesome. But, uh, yeah, thank you for doing this. You want to just plug your uh, – he's going to go blind now, so let me hurry up. Uh, you want to at least plug your gig so people where they can find your information at? Yeah, you can find me at uh, DerekD.com, D-E-R-E-K-D.com. You'll see my Twitter there, my Facebook there, um, YouTube, all that stuff. And I host a show called Fast Lane Daily. Fast Lane Daily. You go to FastLaneDaily.com. It'll just take you to the YouTube page. Um, EpicsHD.com. If you have Verizon and you have it, you have definitely heard my voice. Um, and that's about it. Just, yeah. Follow me on Twitter if you want. If you don't, I don't give a fuck. It's cool if you do. That's about it. <laughs> All right. This is Jay with Gagwater, Derek D. Make sure you follow him more. He doesn't give a fuck. All right. Peace.